pense que je suis amoureux d'un autre homme. Quoi Même si je suis consciente que pour l'Église, c'est très difficile de nommer la pédophilie. Le père Achille est coupable, et vous le savez. L'Église est morte. Elle pourrit de l'intérieur. J'ai ici une liste d'accusations calomnies. What attracted you to the subject matter of your film? I, I think the first thing was... Um... I was angry on the, 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 Catholic, uh, the Catholic Church that doesn't answer, didn't answer to those family who had uh, encountered that, 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 that kind of problems, of um, pedophile problems. And I was angry and after that I, I told myself and with my co-author um, Philippe Falardo, uh, who's come from Quebec, um, that it had to be something like a comedy. When you're angry, when, when, when the subject is so serious, you, <laughs> I think you have, to, you have to make a comedy, uh, like, like, like Chaplin did, like, like, uh, and, and we tried to do it. Like that. Les infidèles sont partout. C'est comme un cancer. Once or twice in the movie, I almost jumped out of my seat. I had to cover my eyes as well a couple of times. Is employing that moment of surprise an important element of your filmmaking? Would you say? Oh yes, it is. Yes, it is because I think it's uh, it's how you catch the audience. You you have to catch the audience with a, with, with with surprise and with a. Uh, big moment they don't imagine to to, to live <laughs> when they are they are watching the movie and uh, I think I think we we did it I think I think it works uh, and I think the, the first big surprise uh, is the suicide uh, of that young boy and. Uh, but the next, the next scene is also a surprise because it's like so, so crazy when that woman uh, tells about uh, the, the big chance uh, the mother had to, to have a, 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 dead, a dead boy uh, to be um, uh, closer, cl closer, closer of, da of God. And I think that's, a, that's also a surprise. C'est une bonne arme. On l'a bien en main. One thing your film reminded me of was the last two films by Tarantino, which are both revenge fantasies. I, I love those movies, and uh, I, I think I like Django. I, I don't really like the end of Django. I like I like Django till the last ten minutes, but uh, because I think revenge, revenge is an important part of our life. But revenge is um, as dangerous as the. the as the, the, it's so dangerous. It's it's. I think it's uh, it's dangerous. Like 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 faith and like religion here is. Then uh, be careful with 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 vengeance. And at the end of the movie, we tried, uh, and I tried to 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 show that revenge is not is not an option. It's uh, it's. Uh, Oh, you say that when when a street goes to end, it's um, cul-de-sac. Exactly. Dead end street. It's it's a dead end. It's a dead end, and uh, you can you can find a solution in vengeance because vengeance is vengeance never ends. If you if you never end. If 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 you try to imagine if you if I if I if you do something to me and I revenge. By some something uh, doing something to you, maybe your mother will revenge him to me, and my children will revenge to your mother, and and what is the end?